Hey guys, it's Borix and hello. Welcome to my channel if you are new here. Welcome back if you've been here before. So today guys, we're filming was handsome as man as handsome as men alive 30 to 35 division. Guys, for a second, I forgot how to face the camera towards me. I look a little blush today. So guys, um the order I have it in is not the order we're gonna go in because Okay, so I'm going to add a disclaimer. This has nothing to do with sexual orientation of the men on the list. It has nothing to do with marital status, relationship status. The only person's sexual orientation comes to play in this video is my own. I'm slapping my leg on my hand on my leg. So, guys, one, well, it's not one because you see I got nothing on the list. But we're going to go with the one, the Italian actor's name. I have trouble pronouncing it. I can remember it. One we're gonna go with see Giacomo Gian Auntie. Sorry if I messed it up. My Italian is not too good. That is cute. Played in I get I got this guys. Great. Great anatomy? Guys, I should Google this stuff before I make a video. <laughs> He's okay. He's cute. Kind of my type, but then not completely, you know. Born in Rome, which was really impressive. Is in Canada. Sorry, guys. I don't know if pretty them. Six nineteen. Nineteen. Wait, I mean June nineteenth will be thirty-five. I mean thirty-five is still on this count, guys. But then they go over. This is from 35 to 39. Okay, guys, I don't know too, too much about him, so we're going to go back to... I put his one. Number two, Boo Boo Stewart, born January 21st, 1994. He's 31 years old. Boo Boo Stewart is pretty popular. People know who he is. He played... In Descendants is Jay, but he actually, guys, broke out as playing in Twilight as at Clearwater. He's a singer. He does concerts. He does really cool stuff. He's a really handsome guy. Long hair. I would date Boo Boo Stewart. But I'm at the point where I'm like, okay. Number three, maybe somebody you guys never heard of. And I should not in my channel. Mike Feist. Uh, he was in Dear Evan Hansen. He's a Broadway actor slash now also I did regular acting. But I think I just little sort of piece of hair took my years. Mike Feist, born January 5th, 1992. He had really long hair. Now, guys, can I be honest? I, he was playing Connor, like I said, in Dear Evan Hansen. I actually prefer him with long hair. I think the long hair is flattering to Mike versus the short hair. I don't know. Maybe it's just my opinion. I don't know. Take it with a grain of salt. But if Mike is watching this video, I'm not trying to offend him. I doubt he would be. But I mean, from a straight heterosexual to a straight cis woman, that's just my opinion. Troy, or is Troy Jen? You guys, I can't read handwriting. <laughs> My handwriting, guys, I'm vision impaired. Tori. Yeah, generally. It's, guys, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing his name wrong. He plays most notable playing Barry in the Goldbergs. I'm trying to speak slow enough for you guys to understand. Born 27th of October 1993. He's 30 years old. He played in Hotel for Dogs. I love that movie as well. He's like trying to get with all the girls. He's pretty cute. There's not too, too much known of Troy or much of the members of the JTP. <laughs> I'm going to feel bad for no one now when I'm done making this video because he's. <laughs> okay, guys. Five is Sam Warner. Born 9, 21, 1993. Who plays Jeff in the Goldbergs? He's pretty cute. 
Guys, this video, I love us all the boy Goldbergs in this video. And the male Goldbergs. They're in the age range. Uh, there's not love too much I can find out about Sam on the internet. I seem to have a thing for men named Sam. So if you're new to my channel, well, that's a real creepy little fun fact you know about me. <laughs> I think he plays Jeff. Really cool. Guys, look, my book is starting to mess up now. Okay, so six is Jane. Shane, that's a Jane. Sorry, guys, it's a Shane. Top one, one, fourteen, nineteen, ninety-one. Who played? He played an iCarly as a character, I believe, named Shane, and then he played Matt Bradley, Matthew Bradley in the Goldbergs. Pretty cute guy. The actor, the real Matt Bradley, even said he's much handsomer than I was. I was like, got that right. Shane's gorgeous. Shane never wants a date. Okay. Now I'm going to skip number seven because number seven is number one. I put number one last. This is really hard, guys. I pick a number one. Number eight, Max Lloyd Jones, born. To, now, guys, I can't find a direct birthday. Now, let's say his birthday is February 26, 1991. I found articles on my life. It says February 24th, 1991. And I heard of February 6th, 1991. I just go by what MLB, M, the, M, the actor page says, but I would go by February 24th, and what they said now it's 6th. So February, February 26th, so we're not really sure. Max Lloyd Jones played David Durango in Sandlot. He was in a lot of shows. He even was in one episode of Supernatural. I recognized him immediately. He was in an episode of Teen Wolf playing. Allison's dad, younger, and I was like, is that my boyfriend? I was like, you're good, okay, so my boyfriend, it, was, it is. Nine guys is Devin Bostick, born 11, 13, 1991. So I guess I'm Max. This is 33, Devin's 32. Because I looked it up, because I thought he was born the 20th. Devin Bostick, guys. Devin played Roderick in Diary of Wimpy Kid. That he's most known for it. He played, who else has Devin played? He played in Dead Before Dawn. It's Casper. He played in The 100 as Jasper. He's really cute. Ten is Richard Harmon, born August 18, 1991. So he's 32 years old. He played in a movie about a boy who is vision impaired blind. He played in a movie... A couple of different movies, but the main thing I know him from was playing the 100. Other TV shows, he's why I love SpongeBob SquarePants. Richard is just so cute and so pale. I'm like, yes, please. Fun fact, guys, about Richard does not do Richard. My ex used to be abusive to me over Richard Harmon. So I'm in another one on the list. Okay. So 11 is Freddie Highmore, born 2 for February 14, 1992. He's 32. Guys, another fun fact about this is I had an ex who was abusive to me over Freddie Highmore. He was just a creep, and I should never run that. Anyway, he played in Charlie and Chocolate Factory. He played in Bates Motel. He played Norman Bates. He played Sean. He played Sean in The Good Doctor. And his ability to, be able to speak Spanish and be able to speak all these other languages was really attractive to me at the time. I was really heavily into him. 13. Is Cole Sprouse, born August 4th, 1992. Guys, actually, I've been meaning to do Cole and Dylan videos completely, like, on the twins. I've loved them since I was, like, five. Cole played the little boy in Big Daddy. He played um, Cody in Sweet Life is Zack and Cody. Cody in Sweet Life is Zack and Cody on deck. He has played so many characters. Played Jughead in the, 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 the Riverdale. He has played Ben in Friends. He's played so many characters. I used to say Dylan was my favorite twin, and then Cole became my favorite. Then it was Dylan, and this is like I'm just neutral. And then it was Cole again, and then it was just a neutral. Thirteen, Dylan Sprouse, also born eight, August fourth, nineteen ninety two, because they're twins. Dylan is twin B, Cole is twin A. They're 15. No, Dylan's between A, Cole is twin B. They're more than 15 minutes apart. They played in Big Daddy together. 
played in played Zach in Sweet Life of Zach and Cody. He's really really dipped off for a while. I know he's coming back, so that is absolutely great because I love the Sprouse twins. Okay, fourteen is Luke Newton, born February fifth, nineteen ninety three. Luke Newton is really handsome. He the only thing I know him for playing is Bridgerton. He plays Col Colton. Colton, sorry guys, Colin. Um, he's pretty cute. He's not my favorite brother of the pack of the four. No, it's Benedict, but whatever. So yeah, he's cute. He's definitely one of the cuter kids they have, and he's in a band and all. But there's not too too much I can say on Luke because I don't know too too much about him. Fifteen is Alexander Ludovic, born five May fifth, nineteen ninety. Sorry guys, May seventh. See, I hand rain sloppy. 1992, 31, almost 32 years old. If you guys know me, guys, I am the biggest Alexander Ludwig fan. I loved him in his single days, guys. I won't go too much in detail. Like, for example, he played in the Hunger Games. Oh, guys, hold on, Mac, let me think for a minute. Guys, the first notable thing I seen Alexander Ludwig in was in Seeker the Dark is Rising, where he's playing the seventh son of a seventh son. Where he has to stop this evil and get back his twin brother that he didn't even know he had. Next, he played it Seth in the race to Witch Mountain. Where he played this alien boy. Now, guys, the name Seth is difficult for me to pronounce. So I'm going to keep that in mind. He played Kato in the Hunger Games. Yeah, the bad boy. <laughs> and then he played Beeren, I believe, is the name process, in Vikings. Mm-mm. Wasn't married with a kid. 16 is Josh Hutcherson, born 10, August 12th, 1992, 31 years old. He played in Bridget Terabithia as Jess. He played in The Hunger Games as Cato. He played, there's two notable roles, and a guy he's like looks exactly like him. Okay, 17, Charles Milton, born January 4th, 1991. He's 33. The only when well, he played Mad Boys along with Alexander Ludwig, he played Reggie in Riverdale. Um, he, he's really cute, guys. We're starting out of time now. Will Poulter is number 18. January 28th, 1993. He is 31. He played the he had quite a few different shows, but the main character I know of him as is he played. Hold on. Played Eustace Clarence Scrub in Narnia in the, the Walden version. I was like, yes. He has played in the Maze Runner. This guy has been all over the place. He played Kenny in We're the Millers. Guys, I have a We're the Millers story time for you guys. It's going to come up sometime. We already did that one. Cameron Monaghan is 20, born August 16, 1993, 30 years old. Guys, Cameron's mom, I heard, was a single mother who chose to have her baby. Queen! Let me just say, guys, if I was in that situation, I would have done what Cameron's mom did. Have that baby! So, guys, he played Ian in Shameless. He played, he played, I believe, the Joker in another movie. I haven't seen, he played in um, Vampire Academy. He has done a lot of cool things, guys. And he's redheaded, which is my type. By the way, Geeky are one of my type. Last, but certainly not least, number 19, I believe. Ben Platt, born September 24, 1993. Who played Evan, the original Evan, and dear Evan Hansen. And I don't really know too, too much about him other than his husband to be hard. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Guys, that's a call. I didn't want to do it on camera. Is Noah Galvin. You think I'd be jealous of Ben Platt, guys? No. I wrote it in the most handsomest man alive. So am I a hypocrite, my little jelly? So guys, like I said, it started out where I had a crush on Noah, and it spread to Ben. And now I'm just like, gosh, I want both of them. <laughs> okay, guys, this is with a weird video. My lips are all chapped today. I'm going to comment, like, share, subscribe. Go and hit that bell to get post notifications every time I upload. Remember, to my next uploaded video. I love you all. Bye, guys.